I'm Russ Dolezal, 106 Bears Run Drive. My family moved to Loveland 10 years ago. And uh, before that, I was in Blue Ash. We moved to Blue Ash in 1976, and I was uh, a youngster then. But I joined the Special Events Committee in 1981. We, were, we put on the first uh, Taste of Blue Ash. It was only four restaurants at the time. Now it's huge. But every time we go for those Taste of Blue Ash meetings uh, and uh, the Special Events Committee meetings, we would see these signs and, and pictures of the plans that Vic Soon, the city manager at the time, and his assistant, Marvin Thompson, would put out. And uh, we'd see these great pictures and, and good drawings, and everybody got a chance to really look at it for a good long time. There was a lot of patience involved in the process of, of getting a good uh, downtown municipal building and recreation building. And so, and you've all been there now. It looks great, and it works wonderfully. It's a great, great place to be. But uh, uh, local governments, there's a couple times they could have used patients down in Cincinnati too, I mean, with the lease, the bangle sign. That everyone's regretting that, right? That was a they could use some patients then, and maybe perhaps a streetcar. If they would use some patients then, there would be less money hemorrhaging there. And even last week, you know, Cranley's office is, is under fire for making a a, a day that uh, honored somebody who shouldn't have been honored. And that little patience there would have helped. So I'd like to end this talk with a quote from William Bruce Rose Jr. Most of us know him as Axel Rose. <laughs> Said woman, take it slow. It'll work itself out fine. All we need is just a little patience. Ah! Now we're cooking with gas. Here we are. <laughs>